special store there. And Alyssa wants to go back to Haiti as a yearly experience like her family does each season. Well, now moving to another serious topic that doesn't get a lot of focus, but probably should. We hear about the importance of adoption, of life, and about the area pro-life and pregnancy resource centers. What we don't hear as much about are healing opportunities for those who've gone through abortion. This next interview focuses on just that. Dancy is with Sherry Neuenschwander, the Ohio Director for Concepts for Truth, about some upcoming seminars, as well as the special endorsement from Focus on the Family. Dancy? Well, joining me now is Sherry Neuenschwander, and Sherry is the director of the Ohio Office of Concepts of Truth International. And I'm going to let Sherry explain what that is and how you help women and men locally. And I want to welcome you to the show. Thank you, Dancy. I appreciate this opportunity. Sure. Concepts of Truth International has a heart to reaching those who are hurting from the pain of abortion, whether that be women or men, because mm -hmm. this is not just a woman's issue. Right. And so we offer abortion recovery here locally um, in the communities um, several times a year. We're going to have one in February, and also we're planning one for in October. So these are confidential settings, um, very small, intimate groups that gives the woman or the man the opportunity to go through the grieving process in a healthy biblical manner. Definitely needed and yes. um, your program receives special recognition nationwide. Do you want to tell us about that? Right. Our curriculum model is Concepts of Recovery, The Journey and I am one of the staff writers so I've been blessed to be able to be part of this project but we're thrilled and excited and humbled to announce that Focus on the Family has endorsed our curriculum model Concepts of Recovery, The Journey, is now on their website, Focus on the Family, as well as Amazon.com. So anyone that's interested in maybe looking at that and uh, getting it, they have that opportunity to do so. Good for you. What did they, when they looked at it, did they give you any um, specifics as to what um, was particularly attractive or um, really beneficial that maybe other programs don't offer? Actually, they said it was very, uh, spiritually and clinically sound okay. and they said that they highly recommend it because it addresses it expertly as well as um, compassionately so what's different about ours is we have hands-on activities hands-on activities that help move the trauma and so we have exper um, experimental experimental uh, <laughs> experimental um, yeah activities that helps. Um, so it's it's very unique. It's a very unique program. And as you said, this is an organization, Concepts of Truth. Actually, it's international. Yes. Um, and you are the Ohio director, so you're overseeing several locations then. Actually, the CEO and founder, Millie Lace, is our head director okay. in Wynn, Arkansas, but I am the one in Ohio. Yes. And we have a satellite office now in New Jersey. So we're really excited that God is expanding our territory. Definitely. And we have an international helpline for abortion recovery. So we receive calls from all 50 states and internationally. We've received calls from Canada, Puerto Rico, uh, Dubai, Middle East, Japan. So we're able to listen, assess the caller's needs and refer them to local help, whether that be a pregnancy center or a, a church or a Christian counselor that is ready to help them. When you talk about counseling um, after abortion, you know, I would think that there are women and men who would need the counseling immediately. Mm -hmm. And I would think it could be several years down the road, decades down the, down the road. Do you find that, um, you know, when you are setting up these counseling sessions twice a year that you run the gamut? Yes. When someone calls, they're at different places in their journey mm -hmm. because healing after an abortion is a journey. And so we talk about post-abortion trauma, which is the inability to deal with all the emotions. So um, yes, we handle that differently. So you might be at the beginning stages or you might be in denial for 30 years. It just depends. So when they come out of that denial, we are there to help them with that process. I think so often that women would be afraid that they would be shamed because you know the, the act has, has been done and they can't take it back so what do you do right there is a lot of shame because it's done in secret it's it's that society does not give us the opportunity to grieve there is no body there's no baby if you lost someone to a natural causes there's that public 
expression of that grief. It's an unresolved grief when it comes to abortion. So we give them that opportunity to give voice and to process that, process that grief and bring closure. Are you seeing the rates of abortion dropping at all in the United States? Um, I'm not sure of that statistic, to be honest with you. One out of three women have had an abortion within the church. Uh, Is that right? One out of three. And so women who've had an abortion in their past have an 81% uh, increased risk of having emotional mental issues. Um, so when we heal, when a woman or a man heals, we become a powerful voice for truth and for life. So the more we talk about it and the more people come forward and, and get healed, then the Lord can use to perhaps stop abortion. Definitely. So where can they call to get help? How do they reach you to find out even more about Concepts of Truth? Right. Concepts of Truth um, International, you can go to our website, which is internationalhelpline.org, okay. or you can call our helpline, which is there 24-7, 1-866-482-LIFE, 1-866-482-5433. Okay. And if um, anyone is interested in acquiring the counseling, this session is full, but there will be another one, so there is hope out there for another a time We for are you. planning October 23rd through the 25th. Okay. So if anyone wants to call that helpline, they will connect you to me. Okay, wonderful. Sherry Neuenschwander, thank you so much for being with us and thank you for your work. Oh, well, thank you and God be the glory.